I know you're gonna dig this. I don't understand what Alright, this is what happened, but you are in here, so you missed it. Forgive me, internet, for I have not vlogged all day. Oh. <laughs> I've been so busy working on the second to last puppet show. Actually, it's the next to last puppet show before the end of Big Brother 18, so that is up on Patreon, and it should be up not long after this goes up for everybody else on uh, Mad Rose D. We're almost to the turtle spot. Yeah, don't no repeat, please. <laughs> yeah, I don't want to um, have to deal with another turtle today. Just stay to the side, kids. Stay to the side. So it's Saturday. It's shopping day time. I have to pick up some food, uh, well, some ingredients because I'm um, going to the shower tomorrow, which is actually a sprinkle. Um, if you're a girl, you probably know that's for a second or third or fourth baby, whatever. But a shower is for a first baby because you get showers of expensive presents for the first one and then just like clothes and stuff for the second Big one. <laughs> You get one roll of film so that for the second baby you can at least fit birth and graduation pictures on one roll. <laughs> Am I right? Oh, there's yeah. a gopher. You know how it is. The first baby's like, hallelujah. And you take about five million pictures. By the time you have the second baby, you could have one album of their whole life. Maybe just one roll of film, but I'm dating myself. They don't really, people don't really use rolls of film anymore. In case you were wondering, it's usually about 36 pictures. Sometimes 22 pictures, I think, was in a standard roll of film. Back in the day when we used film. Right, everything's digital now, so. Or cell phone, which is digital, but I mean, you can fit a million pictures on there. I think we got our first digital camera, what, around 2000, somewhere around here? Uh, Remember when Sean threw it out the window? Oh yeah. That was 2002. Right. So we had already had it for like. Little. Yeah. So it was probably about 2000. One, 2002. Maybe. No, 2002. Oh, was that new? Well, yeah. Oh man. Yeah, because he threw it out the window in like October. Right. So we only had it for like about six months or so. Maybe not even. Yeah. Thank you, Sean. We didn't have one before that. I thought we had another one I before don't think that. So I think the Fuji, because that was a Fuji. I think that was the first one. Um, I thought he threw the second one out the window. In any case, that wasn't fun. Nor the TV off the dresser, or <laughs> many and other many things other. that. Uh, yeah. So it's very hot today. Sorry for the air noise, but the air conditioning is a blasting in here because it down. is. It's humid. It's very humid. So that ShopRite, you know, I should have brought a sweater with me because ShopRite's going to be freezing and I have no sleeves on. Hey, look at that bad boy. Look at that tractor. Dude, you got to Oh, you only have about four or five cars behind. Oh, here's another tractor. Oh, another. no, another tractor. Is it a tractor show or something? Tractor race. That girl was driving. Probably at uh, GM Day. GM Day? What's that? General. Oh. <laughs> It's General Montgomery Day today, guys. You know, the General Montgomery from the uh, Revolutionary War? Yeah. Our, vi our, what would you call it? Our town is named after him. So, congrats, General Montgomery. Your name will live on in Orange County. <laughs> All right, so uh, let's get to getting it. Shop right. All right, guys, I'm just waiting here for Mark. He ran into the liquor store, enjoying the sunset. Probably can't see it as majestic as it is to me right now, but... Oh, <laughs> I locked him out. <laughs> How'd you do? Did you win? Are you a winner? I don't know. Oh, I thought you were checking a ticket, too. Oh. The sunset's really pretty, but don't stare at it and try and absorb its energy. It's probably not a good idea. No. Even though Granny used to stare at the sun. Oh, boy. <laughs> that explains a few things. Yes. Alright, we made it back. Got a pretty good haul today. Didn't get a lot of stuff. Got a good amount. 
So I, this also includes like stuff I'm making for the party tomorrow too. So <laughs> got some uh, Italian bread, which is going to be Sean. Sean, please. <laughs> Got some Italian bread, which is going to be made into vegan French toast, but not just vegan French toast, vegan stuffed French toast. And it's going to be stuffed with coconut cream and berries, three different types, raspberries, blueberries, strawberries, good stuff. Got some oat bran bread here. These were still on sale for $1.99 and they're both vegan so I got them spicy kung pao and sesame chicken. Uh, I got another boca chicken, uh, veggie chicken. Got a bag, the first bag this season of local apples. These are ginger golds and we didn't get a lot of rain so the apples are really small this season. Which is fine because sometimes you don't feel like eating a giant apple. Sometimes a small apple is nice especially if your name is Mark. Mark doesn't like big apples, so perfect for him. Some vegan chocolate that was on sale for $1.99. These Simply Potatoes were... I always wait for these to go on sale to like $99, but they were $1.49. So I said, you know what? That's pretty good too. So we got a sweet potato one, mashed sweet potatoes. This is not vegan, but these two are the Steakhouse Seasoned Diced Potatoes. I got some ingredients for uh, ramen here. I got bean sprouts and shredded carrots. Tomorrow's going to be a little bit cooler, so tomorrow night might be a nice night to have a little ramen for dinner with some gyoza because I still have a ton of gyoza in the freezer. Love, love, love the seventh generation uh, dish, dish soap. So I got another one to hold in reserve because I filled up my big um, brown bottle with the 7th generation and this barely makes, you know, that's smaller than the big brown bottle so I'm going to need more. Some craft beer fries, I think for tonight. Some candles for Kristen's cake on Monday. She requested a vegan dessert. So I said, how about a vegan brownie with some uh, vegan ice cream on the top? So she said, okay, that sounds good. So I got two ice creams here. I got a peanut uh, banana with chocolate fudge. These are both vegan. And a pistachio with sea salt caramel. That looks really good. All right, so we have the berries and the strawberries. And I got some more of uh, roasted red peppers to, to uh, put in the vegan nacho sauce, yellow sauce. Some diced green chilies. Love those. They add a lot of flavor, not a lot of spice. The organic pasta was on sale for $1.25 a pound, so that was awesome. The uh, half sours, because we took the other ones back because they were, they were a little bit over fermented and they were like stinging your mouth when you ate them, so... Not supposed to do that. I'm sure you won't get sick from it. It's just not real pleasant to eat like that. Some scallions, of course, because they make everything better. Week. What? Although we both got sick last week. Yeah, but I don't think it was from that. At least I hope not. <laughs> I hope not. Got some dog meat chicken over here. And then uh, over here we have some cranberry pomegranate. I got that to make my uh, kombucha and some seltzer variety and some extra virgin olive oil that was on sale. That was really a pretty good buy that you found there, honey. I think that was $5.99. That was like $5 off for the extra virgin olive oil. He always sniffs out a great bargain. Mmm, dinner time. Let's go, you little french fry freakas. <laughs> Weekas. Alright, fair enough. Here's the dinner. Alright, we're closing in on some beer batter french fries. And then we have some marinated salmon steaks for the boys. Maddie and I are having this... Whoa, 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 wait. We're going to have to circle around. Not enough landing spot there. Alright. That is uh, teriyaki chicken strips. Chicken strips. And the big flyover kale salad. Whoa, what's in there? Pine nuts, tomatoes, scallion, kale, some uh, vinaigrette. What? 
salt and pepper. Lucy's coming busting in here. <laughs> she said, where's that kale? Mommy. That's all mine. <laughs> this is all for General Montgomery. Yes, what's that? That's your favorite chicken with the grill marks Ooh, on it. Oh, I love that. Favorite chicken, which is the... Uh, it is one of my favorites right now. Yeah. What was the name of it? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Beyond Chicken. What's the sauce? Uh, it's a teriyaki. It's also mixed with some of the Target chicken. So it's chicken roulette. Okay. Right? <laughs> right? Yeah. Hey, guys. <laughs> you got like a lot? No. Okay. I'm in, I'm in my Natalie mode. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah. <laughs> oh, you're all holding the spoon. You can say that. <laughs> GT. <laughs> GT, girl GT. Power, girl power. You're, GT. You're also uh, Bridget. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and you were all. You were. Um, <laughs> Bronte. Bronte. You were Natalie, though. I'm Natalie. Yeah. yeah. I'm Natalie. Stop trying to take my cred. <laughs> you can have that. It's okay. Thanks. I think we both do a good niche, though, but you are the hands-down winner. <laughs> it hurts my, my voice to do the meat. I got voted out. <laughs> I don't think I was a target, but I, I guess I'm still loud. here. Well, my ears. she's really loud. Yeah, well. She's like yell talking. Everybody it's yells weird. on that show. No, but no, like they don't. she's normal conversation age. Corey's does not yell on that show. He's barely he's awake. Up, yeah. <laughs> Can they get him out of his bed for five minutes to do a DR session? I don't think so. All right, we're going to enjoy this sumptuous feast that Mark has provided us and the Lord has blessed. <laughs> okay. Dear baby Jesus. Dear don't you even. <gasps> don't you even do Dear that. seven pound, three ounce <laughs> baby Jesus in your crib. I thought this was Homer first, so I was going to pet it, but it's not. It's uh, not. I think you need to get your <laughs> eyes rechecked. Maybe. <laughs> What's up, you nut? <laughs> I don't know. I'm a nut. Ian a rut. Remember that song that, uh... No. Shawnee used to listen to that chum the um, uh, go Oh, is that from that? Not too much. <laughs> I could do a little less. Are you serious? I don't want to get heartburn. Jennifer, oh, I bet you would like this beautiful okay. Brazil nut. <laughs> Alright, status update. We've got about half an hour left of Stranger Things. Oh. I'm going to have a meltdown. I just know that there's going to be cliffhangers and I can't handle it. I can't hang. <laughs> it's like going to the jury house of Stranger Things. I just... Oh my god, it's so good. You guys have to watch it. If you're not watching it, you have to watch it! What are you doing with your life? <laughs> Put everything down. It'll wait. Mm -hmm. Go watch Stranger mm -hmm. Things. Please tell me the new season's coming out soon. No. They have to, like, write it and stuff. <laughs> write it and make it. What about Barb? <laughs> Don't do any spoilers. I won't. Okay. But I did see on uh, one of the talk shows, hashtag justice for Barb. Well, you know what that's all about. <laughs> yeah. Alright. And then Barb came out. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you guys so much for chatting with us if you were at the live show. It was a lot of fun. It was a good time. we got a busy, busy day tomorrow. I gotta say, David, I hope you have a great first day of college. Oh, yay! <laughs> So proud, so happy, so proud. It's exciting. Have a great, great time. Mm -hmm. And everybody who stopped by, thank you so much. And we have a special birthday shout out. <laughs> it's Kristen's birthday. 20 In minutes. 20 minutes. We're going to pull T out minus the... 20 minutes. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Oh, <laughs> uh, uh. Yeah. Kristen is old mm -hmm. and you're old 
She's Happy playing. She's not old. She's playing Pokemon. <laughs> you know what I got to say? Happy birthday, Queen Pooh. Yeah. All right. Big up yourself. And on that note, <laughs> till next time. Bye. Bye. Bye.